Welcome to part nine, I think, of the David Tennant tutorial. Because I am deaf in this ear today. We are kind of pretty much almost done. Let's get on with it. So I'll bring this camera in. Uh, about there, I think. Ooh, close. And there are probably quicker ways to do it or more simplified ways to do it um you know could probably use a airbrush and something like that but i don't i hand paint them and i like the fact that when i do them they are made up of several layers and take a bit of time and then how much do i want his eyebrow to be doing the David Tennant thing. What happens when you paint the various layers of darker and darker brown on top and then some highlights and then individual um, individual hairs, that layer there helps to blend it back into the skin so it doesn't look like a quite a harsh thing so it doesn't look like a dark caterpillar crawling across his face it just helps because of the scale blend it in and make it seem like something that is naturally there and i've just realized hang on hello <laughs> completely forgot to put me in the corner okay so i'm now mixing some umber in with that same mix I had so I started off with skin color added some leather brown then I added some gray now I'm adding some umber and what I'm going to do here I'm actually using this brush I was going to use a different brush but this one's working fine for now I've got that color on the brush I'm just rubbing most of it off on my hand just because it's easier and it lets me check how much paint there is and stuff and then I'm going to take that darker color and just blend it on the bits where the eyebrows are the darkest. And the same also goes for not only the shape of eyebrows, because obviously some people have dark eyebrows, some people have eyebrows. I mean, good example, Matt Smith, got a Matt Smith figure up there. He's hardly got any eyebrows. And someone had taken a picture of all the doctors and all the companions and removed all the eyebrows all the way through. And they all looked really, really, really weird until you got to a picture of Matt Smith and he just looked like Matt Smith. He didn't look any different. Okay, so I wanna thin down some more of this brown, but thinner, thinner, thinner. Thinner, 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 Batman. quite dark eyebrows and there's no gray hairs there's no light brown hairs or anything like that so all i'm trying to do here is give the impression of the gaps through the hair where you can see the skin what these do for me at least is just break it up a bit and make it a little bit more random and even if the guy doesn't have gray hair it will look like reflections off off the sky or off you know wherever light source is there seeing as somehow that clock is telling me that this has been recording for 50 minutes 50 when i'm painting time no idea painting takes longer than i think and the sun has come out again Take care, guys. See you soon.